And he taught Adam the names, all of them. Then he showed them to the angels and said, Inform me of the names of these, if you are truthful. They said, Exalted are you. We have no knowledge except what you have taught us. Indeed, it is you who is the knowing, the wise. And mention when we said to the angels, Prostrate before Adam. So they prostrated, except for Iblis. He refused and was arrogant and became of the disbelievers. And we said, O Adam, dwell, you and your wife, in paradise, and eat therefrom in ease and abundance from whatever you will. But do not approach this tree, lest you be among the wrongdoers. But Satan caused them to slip out of it and remove them from that condition in which they had been. And we said, Go down, all of you, as enemies to one another, and you will have upon the earth a place of settlement and provision for a time. Indeed, Allah chose Adam and Noah and the family of Abraham and the family of Imran over the worlds. And recite to them the story of Adam's two sons in truth, when they both offered a sacrifice to Allah, and it was accepted from one of them, but was not accepted from the other. Said the latter, I will surely kill you. Said the former, Indeed, Allah only accepts from the righteous who fear him. And we have certainly created you, O mankind, and given you human form. Then we said to the angels, Prostrate to Adam. So they prostrated, except for Iblis. He was not of those who prostrated. And, O Adam, dwell, you and your wife, in paradise, and eat from wherever you will, but do not approach this tree lest you be among the wrongdoers. But Satan whispered to them to make apparent to them that which was concealed from them of their private parts. He said, Your Lord did not forbid you this tree, except that you become angels or become of the immortal. And he swore by Allah to them, Indeed, I am to you from among the sincere advisers. So he made them fall through deception. And when they tasted of the tree, their private parts became apparent to them, and they began to fasten together over themselves from the leaves of paradise. And their Lord called to them, Did I not forbid you from that tree and tell you that Satan is to you a clear enemy? They said, Our Lord, we have wronged ourselves, and if you do not forgive us and have mercy upon us, we will surely be among the losers. Allah said, Descend, being to one another enemies, and for you on the earth is a place of settlement and enjoyment for a time. He said, Therein you will live, and therein you will die, and from it you will be brought forth. And mention when we said to the angels, Prostrate to Adam, and they prostrated, except for Iblis. He said, Should I prostrate to one you created from clay? And we have certainly honored the children of Adam, and carried them on the land and sea, and provided for them of the good things, and preferred them over much of what we have created, with definite preference. And mention when we said to the angels, Prostrate to Adam, and they prostrated, except for Iblis. He was of the jinn, and departed from the command of his Lord. Then will you take him and his descendants as allies other than me, while they are enemies to you? Wretched it is for the wrongdoers as an exchange. Those were the ones upon whom Allah bestowed favor from among the prophets of the descendants of Adam and of those we carried in the ship with Noah and of the descendants of Abraham and Israel and of those whom we guided and chose. When the verses of the Most Merciful were recited to them, they fell in prostration and weeping. And we had already taken a promise from Adam before, but he forgot, and we found not in him determination. And mentioned when we said to the angels, Prostrate to Adam, and they prostrated, except Iblis, he refused. So we said, O Adam, 
Indeed, this is an enemy to you and to your wife. Then let him not remove you from paradise so you would suffer. Indeed, it is promised for you not to be hungry therein or be unclothed. And indeed, you will not be thirsty therein or be hot from the sun. Then Satan whispered to him. He said, O Adam, shall I direct you to the tree of eternity and possession that will not deteriorate? And Adam and his wife ate of it, and their private parts became apparent to them, and they began to fasten over themselves from the leaves of paradise. And Adam disobeyed his Lord and erred. Then his Lord chose him and turned to him in forgiveness and guided him. Allah said, Descend from paradise, all your descendants being enemies to one another. And if there should come to you guidance from me, then whoever follows my guidance will neither go astray in the world nor suffer in the hereafter. Like the custom of the people of Noah and of Ad and Thamud and those after them, and Allah wants no injustice for his servants. But if they turn away, then say, I have warned you of a thunderbolt like the thunderbolt that struck Ad and Thamud. As for Ad, they were arrogant upon the earth without right and said, Who is greater than us in strength? Did they not consider that Allah who created them was greater than them in strength? But they were rejecting our signs. <laughs>